Hey there folks, it's Lori Shaw, owner of Professional Pet Sitting, and I wanted to pass along a little information to you today. Um, while I was out and about today, I stopped by the pet store to pick up some items for work. And while I was waiting in line, I happened to notice that there was this free treat or free sample kiosk um, near the register. So while I was waiting, I began rummaging through to see what they had in there. And I found a new interesting product, but I wanted to preface this by saying that most pet stores have something like this in their store. A lot of times they'll be near the register. Uh, I've also seen them near the products that they're trying to sell, and that's what they're there for. Their product reps come in from the pet food companies, and they this is a way for people to try their product before they actually buy the, the big containers of them or larger containers, full size containers. So be on the lookout for those because a lot of times they will have um, sample size dog or cat food, kitten food, puppy food, whatever the case is. Especially if you have a younger pet who doesn't eat a lot or a smaller pet, sometimes those sample sizes are enough for a meal and they'd be great for a long weekend away um, up north or whatever if your pet travels with you really convenient. Just check the expiration dates on those. Um, and it always save the product packaging until the food is finished. And um, that way, if there's any product recalls, the information's on there, of course, too. But I wanted to um, kind of highlight something I saw today. This is in no way an endorsement of this product or this company. I just thought it was kind of an interesting idea. And I'm sure it won't be the last company to do this. But this is a product made by Inaba. It's a Japanese pet food company I've not heard of before. And this is called Chow Churro Cat Treat Paste. So the first thing that popped into my mind was that this would be super to use if you were doing positive reinforcement training with your cat. So when you think of you're doing a training with them and you offer a cue and a marker and then you treat immediately, your timing is always really important. This would be a super high value treat, especially if your cat's having some trouble or if they're having a really difficult time with, with one specific um, training. And this is this would be a super high value treat. Give them a little squeeze of this and I guarantee you it would probably be much more well received than their dry treats or their soft treats that they're used to having. Another thing that um, would, I think I would use it for a lot, um, I have a lot of clients as you know who have pets that are in hospice and they often have appetites that are kind of mediocre and, and they go up and down. So this is something I'm going to pass along to them um, for their cats. I bought or I picked up a couple of different flavors of each and I'm going to pass those along so that they can talk to their vet to see if they're appropriate for them. More than likely they are. Um, I checked the ingredient profile on their website and that's a very simple um, ingredient list. Nothing that... I wouldn't feel comfortable eating myself, so I think that that says a lot. Um, I haven't opened it yet, so I'm not sure how it smells or how it tastes, um, but my guess is that it would be pretty um, appetizing for a cat. So if you have any questions about your cat's appetite, no matter what condition that they're in or age, it's always a good idea to talk to your vet first um, before kind of consulting Dr. Google or even somebody like me. It's always a good idea to talk to your vet first to see if there's anything going on to rule out any health problems. Um, but if they are having trouble and they do have a health condition, this may be an option for you. Um, this comes in like a one ounce size here. Great size, little would go to waste. Uh, I looked online, these do come in packets. They look to be about two ounces. I'm not sure what the cost is on those, but I think this would be a really super idea. So if you're doing positive reinforcement training, you might want to head over to here on Pet Supply and go by their register and pick up one of these. They're free and uh, definitely want to refrigerate this after opening. If you have any questions about your pets, feel free to get in touch. I'd be happy to answer them as best I can or point you in the right direction.